we are here at the haunted hotel. So guys and welcome back to the channel it's Hilda so today's video guys is an amazing one trust me we are going to the haunted hotel in Zuma Rock guys this um, hotel has been there for over um, 40 years and counting and from stories that we've heard we've heard that um, the hotel has been haunted and that there are ghosts and so many things we've said so today we are going there to go and find out if the stories are true yes if the stories are true that is why we are going there so i'm going to be taking you guys on this adventure because yes it's an adventure and i cannot wait to show you both the haunted hotel all the um, evil stories about the sumaro and so many things so stay tuned <laughs> In less than few minutes, we're already in the Chachi village. Now, we are here because we have to take permission before we step into where the Zuma Rock and its children are. Yes, it's like a tradition. You, you just can't go on your own. So that is why we are here. So guys, as I now, I'm in front of the Emirates Palace, but he's not around. So um, they're directing me to see the secretary that is going to tell me the history about what I want to know. So that is where I am. It's a uh, very wrong information that we are not even aware. We have never seen that even up to now. So um, the, the chief was not around. So we're going to actually look for him. Yeah, because we cannot go further to video without without um getting the permission from the chief so that's where we are going to so he's taking us to where we are going to see the emir <laughs> guys at this point um they said the emir went to for um so is his secretary that we actually um met and he's the one that's going to give us the rundown of the history of the Zuma. Yeah. Yeah. so um from plenty stories we heard yeah they said that um the hotel in the um, Zuma rock that is closed there has been abandoned for about 40 years and and it's still counting that um spirits are the ones spirits from the Zuma rock are the ones that are haunting the hotel yes that's what i've i've heard um and they also say that the, their sacrifices that they make to the caves that they are monsters there lots of things so that's why i've come on my own today to find out if this is true that's what i'm here okay according to our book it's very ashamed we taji labari we akwai iran su spirits ko aljannu da suna hunting hotel din da yana wurin she yasa mutanen wanda suna ginin hotel dama ba su ci gaba da ginin ba ne suna abandoned project din so yawancin stories haka about spirit she yasa ta zo yau ta zo confirm da kanta ko da ke ni ke kare to ki da daga ina ne da su mun dan abuja ne kan a wani company taking it's a private uh, documentary it's personal it's personal personal yeah my company put a personal issue it can't account no personal it can't account yeah and then the youtube profile and the instagram so you tell him your name sorry your name, your name. so my name is hilda hilda ne a takace ce dalila abin da ma yasa har na tsaya nan na kuma saurare ku ita ce ne yana daya daga cikin wannan masarauta 
wanda masarauta ni ina da daga cikin suna na ni a daga nasa kuma ni ne makama na wannan masarauta kuma ni ne magatakarda magatakarda na masarauta to amma yanzu da kuka zo a kashin gaskiya shi mai girma daga ci sarki namu tatsu yar da yatta saboda haka a takaitaccen bayani abin da na sani wanda an shi iyayen mu suka muka tashi muka same su suka ga muna aljanin da ke gurin aljanin ne masan mutane shine spirit ta haifo masan mutane ne magana ne na jama'a kawai wadanda abin bai shafe su ba su suke ƙarya su ce wannan su ce wannan su ce ai aljanin ne ke sa ba a zama gurin wannan ƙarya ne abjana na wannan gurin ma jama'a suke bukata sai dai matsala mu azuma din nan zuma alhi mutane suka dai muka same suka ga ma iyayen mu ni ji kan ji ka da na zuma ba ko gefe gefe ba ni a be ben ji ka ne na zuma abjana aljana so mutane gidan da ake yi kawai Allah ne bai kadara a yi ba sai dai mu alhi zuma wannan muka ta mutane suka tashi suka sani shine duk wanda zai yi mummo na abu ko abin da zai zama domin alheri ba ko dan garin ne to gaskiya ba zai ji da dadi ba saboda an ji mu aljannan na mutane mu da suna akwai abin da suke yi a zuma din kuma aljannan suna son mutane mu muka ce fararan aljan ba buka ke bane so suna son jama'a an ju an za a tashi aiki a ga zo da munfa mai kyau komai za ta tafi daidai ba abin da zai faru abin da iyayen suka ga ya muna kyau duk wanda ya ga ya muku ba ko masu ƙarya wani su ba zuma din suke ba wani su daga wani waje ne wani su daga katsina nufawa kogi wani suna zuwa zuwa ba da labaru na ƙarya wanda yake ba kasansu bane amma aljannu mu gaskiya ne ya musu ga mun suna son mutane mu a lokacin da gurin ma yana kurmi kurmi mutane ma suna zama gurin a gurin suke zama ba ba abin da ke faru a da su saboda mutane ma asalin su masu cin zuma ne da anshin arauta arauta irin na abin da ake da ba bindiga ba ba san bindiga ba lokaci to a gurin suke zaman su a gurin suke rayuwar su suke komai su amma ba ba abin da ke faru a da su abin da na sani okay so sir this um i don't know i don't know what you have said but is but is it true that they are ghosts but is it true that they are ghosts now what you was trying to say what he was trying to say about the ghost aspect is not see it's just like a normal general thing where we whichever village you go they have spirits there yeah? but to them it's not see if it's a bad spirit that them they call them white spirits that's the ones that love people and accept it so that's what he was trying to say so is it true that um they make sacrifices each year to the caves we the gaskeni where akoi sacrifices come ritual da gane wannan alamun ma suna tabbata da yi wannan shekara akwai alheri wannan shekara gaskiya akwai da a yanayi yan da su suke yi ta ko a gaskiya ban ana aladu ya mata ya sure they do normally they not do normally um, do sacrifice every year they just like a normal sacrifice community yeah but they say people don't go to the caves you can't go to the caves right we are going in the anisna wucewa wa ran jusu ya koya da muke kebe te wannan te wannan ciki ne kogore ko mutane goma ko mutane dari ko mutane kawo za su yi kogore ka fa din tayi wannan gurin ko mu din ma ba duka ke tafiya ba sai wannan aka zabe su masu zuwa gurin su suke zuwa so it's only the selected there are particular selected people that are allowed to go in there those are restricted areas. so those people that have gone in there who do they do they see people there who who, who takes the sacrifices da mu shiga wurin wanda ana selecting su shiga wurin wai suna ganin mutane a cikin wurin ne ko so ai ana ma 
So what he's saying is, if for instance they skip a year and then go for the sacrifice, there is a normal the the, the the they normally see something like a tiger, but it's very old. It normally comes out to stay outside the cave. Yeah, you can't touch it. Yeah, you see, it is, you can't touch it. No, that even if you shoot it, it doesn't die. It doesn't even touch it. it okay, just so stays. sir, um, you know this hotel, mm -hmm. the, the hotel that is there. Mm -hmm. They said there was a time that it was um, kept in. It, they wanted to build it in front of the Zuma face, but when you come back, the next after some days you come back, you will not see it again. Exactly. <laughs> So in what he's saying is that in essence it's not as if they don't normally come and see the building or whatever they do there. But it's just that when they come the next day, there's a strong wind that does sweep away most of the project they do. So why it happens that way is because the normal sacrifice or whatever they're supposed to do to the community people they didn't do it so they were trying to like bypass all those things and oh, those okay. and, and then the community people were fully aware of what's going on but they just kept quiet touching. Oh, okay. Mm. So that's okay. 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 Right now, um, we are done. We are about going inside to see the haunted hotel. Stay tuned. <laughs> just here you can see um the zuma rock itself and the one beside it is the wife <laughs> that's what we're told and other rocks are the children of zuma so we're proceeding to go and see like get a clearer view of the zuma rock yeah this is us driving just down to where the zuma rock is and from here we are going to go to um the haunted hotel and guys i wanted to say this um there's a place that we couldn't i couldn't video it very clearly because um that's where they go to do the sacrifices yes yeah, so i couldn't go there. i was <clears throat> i was actually very scared i wouldn't lie yeah but that's where there's a place that um you have to stop you can't go further only people that are chosen to do the to, to make the sacrifices can actually go there yeah so i couldn't go further but yes yeah that's it <laughs> so we are here we are here at the haunted hotel this is the hotel don't get haunted yeah 
So let's go and see if there are ghosts inside this hotel. Najari. Right in front of you is the abandoned stroke haunted hotel. From what the chief told me, he said um, this hotel was here even before he was born and he's over 65. So this hotel has been here for 65 years and more. Seriously, but um, we are here today to find out if it's because it's haunted by the Zuma Rock or it's just an abandoned project. And by the end of this video, you will know. You can see. Are you seeing? So we are going up right now. You can see that the view from here is massive, guys. Okay. Yeah. Well, guys, can you see the view? This is like the second floor. This is the second floor, and the view here is crazy. It's so beautiful. So. after um, one or two talks with the people that have stayed here for a long time we or oh, i discovered that um truly it's just an abandoned project um we heard okay due to what the chief said the chief said um it has been here and that people that were in charge of it um just abandoned it <laughs> i don't really know how true it is but the thought of it was haunted is really not true yes but he still said something that um there's a period that they were that they wanted to build this hotel in front of the zuma rock itself and if you come maybe after two or three days you see that wind will blow everything off and it was really scary but yeah i just feel that this is just an abandoned project it's not really haunted by um the zumaro ghost and all of that yeah this is my own personal thought but yeah he also said that uh, when rain is falling on top of the zumaro you see fire on it that they don't know they just see it and yeah that is it <laughs> so this is the end of our video don't forget to drop your likes your comments they mean a lot and please subscribe bye